hi guys it's Josawa here again with another tutorial for you guys as always so in this particular video i'm going to show you a scalping strategy which you are going to be using to make your first hundred dollar if you are a beginner all right so this strategy is very easy as you guys know that the strategy that i share i always like try to test them all right before coming out to what share with you guys so this one is basically very easy you can basically use this with crypto and what forex all right and in currencies it is what 100 percent legit so you can just try this and basically see make sure you follow the setup step by step if you want to get the same results because i took what over 20 trades and 18 we are winners okay so i'm going to share with you the strategy and i'll be what also taking trades as well so you guys can basically see how this strategy is working out all right if you have not watched my previous strategy which is what sniper entry the link will be in the description so for this particular strategy we are going to use the moving average okay we are going to use what the moving average indicator so whether you are using mt4 or you are using mt5 all right you can also do this in the desktop as well so you just come here when you come to the chart all right when let's just use yeah let's just use the chart of bitcoin so when you come to the chart at the top here okay this is mt5 at the chart at the top here you want to go where this arrow is pointing okay you tab here you are going to see what main chart so you are just going to tab in main chart you are going to see this one that is called moving average okay moving average under this trend indicator trend you are going to see what moving average okay so you are going to tap this moving average when you tap this moving average you are going to see different thing the period the shift the method apply to style levels time time frames okay so please ensure you follow exactly what i'm inputting so we are going to use two what exponential moving average two e m a all right two exponential don't forget we have the simple moving average and the exponential so for this video, for this particular strategy we need to use the ema so the first one we are going to basically set up all right is going to be that of what the 10 okay so you want the period to be 10 okay the shift you want the shift to what be basically what zero okay the shift is going to be zero and when it comes to this one you want to select what exponential the method please make sure it is what exponential okay and after that the apply to you just tab in you want this to what be median okay so when you select median price it's going to see hl and slash two all right and after when you basically like what scroll down this pixel you can select anyone so we are going to use like what three pixel okay and this color all right please make sure you follow up with this the color is supposed to what be blue okay the color is supposed to be blue and the time frames are going to be what all just leave this as they are and you tab in okay all right so if you go to the chart this is what you are going to what basically what see okay this is what you are basically going to see you come again to the top and you tab in main frame again you still go toward the moving average so we have added what the 10 moving average now we are going to add another and uh, one okay we need two exponential moving averages for this second one now the period is going to be 23 for this strategy we are going to use the 10 exponential moving average and the 23 exponential moving average the shift you want to keep it zero all right the method you want to what keep it exponential apply to median as well the only thing you are going to do is what change this color to red okay you change this color to red all right all other setup are just the same so now you are seeing we have two exponential moving uh, averages all right so if you go to the chart this is basically what you are basically going to see okay this is what you are going to what say so now for this strategy please pay key attention for this strategy we are going to use two time frames okay we are going to use two time frame so you just tap in this on the screen you go towards your h4 okay 
we are going to use what the hour four time frame and we are going to use the five minute don't forget this is what a scalping strategy all right which means you just want to enter within a minute five minutes or within 10 15 20 to 30 minutes highest you can go for a scalping is what an hour and you are out of the trade so the first thing you are going to do for this strategy to work is like the hour four all right time all right direction must match what the five minute time frame don't forget you want to check what the hour four the h4 okay because that's the macro what trend you want to see what the main trend is doing which is the h4 and before you go toward the micro trend which is the small one which is the what h4 so we are going to use what h4 and we are going to use what the five minute to do our entry now what are you basically going to look for you want for you to have an entry you if the market is what currently what in a downtrend okay as you are seeing this crossover okay you are seeing this crossover whenever the blue crosses for example whenever what this blue crosses all right this you are seeing crossover whenever the blue cross you want to go forward a buy trade but you are not going to basically use this one currently okay what do i mean whenever what you see this trend it must match our lower time frame for example there is a crossover here currently and you are seeing the market is dropping okay with this crossover whenever what this red okay ama crosses over the blue it means like what the market is trying to what drop to the downside so now you want to look go to the five minute time frame you want to see what the same thing but for this one we are seeing what opposite okay we are seeing basically what opposite okay we are seeing what opposite so which means there is no entry for this particular one you are seeing opposite what direction so the next thing seeing opposite what direction so the next thing so currently what the h4 is different from that of what the five minute time frame if the, when currently you are saying that what the h4 is currently saying this market is what in a downtrend okay this market is trying to what move down so now in short kind of way you want also what the h4 or the m5 to what be equal with this one you want to stay in a particular trend so which means there is no setup currently for this strategy what you need to do is what look for another pair so you can basically like open what ethereum okay like this is ethereum again so now you want to start with what the major what time frame okay so now this one basically you are seeing what there is a crossover here okay there is what a crossover there is a crossover you can see basically like what ethereum has been what moving high okay this is what the hour four so you can see basically like what the the blue exponential moving average which is what our 10 exponential moving average is what above so which means this is what a buy opportunity but for you to confirm this if you are scalping you want to go to the m5 and it must exactly what matches what the major time frame so as you can see this basically is telling us what the h4 is telling us as for a buy and the five minutes also is what showing us what as a buy okay so if you are basically followed there this would be like what a very perfect entry okay this would have been what a very perfect entry so if you enter here this like what over 20 to 30 to 40 pips okay this over 20 to 30 to 40 pips this is basically how you use this strategy okay now you might want to say like in situation like where like the h4 is telling you to what buy and the m5 is telling you to buy but you basically see like what these candles are now what uh, forming and it is like dropping you don't want to enter in short kind of what you want to always enter when there is what crossover it is more legit when there is what crossover either when the 10 moving average is what which is the blue is crossing over the red so you take your buy trade all right or the what red is moving over the blue so now if this basically like close and you see a crossover for a sell 
you want to what confirm from what the higher time frame you want to confirm from what the higher time frame for you to enter for what a buy or what a sell so let's check another pair again let's go to zao okay let's go to zao so we are going to go to what the h4 okay we are going to go to what the h4 so from here you basically see what there is what a crossover all right there is a crossover which means what the market dropped okay the market was what the market drop okay that will have been what dropping okay so this basically shows you firstly the trend okay the macro all right trend the major trend which is the h4 all right so now in this case you want this in the five minute time frame to matches exactly with what the macro trend so you tap begin you go toward the m5 so now you are basically saying like what they are trying to what be a, what a crossover right a crossover there is going to be a crossover right there is now a crossover how do you try to make your entry you just don't enter because now you are seeing what the two emas are like what trying to compress okay you want to wait when they have like a whole kind of gap then you are going to enter for example this candle that is currently forming you want to wait you want to say this candle was closes okay when this candle closes was a bearish candle all right or you look at the body whether the candle is green if they like the buyers really push the price down then it is what a positive is a what a legit what entry then you can basically enter for what yourself all right so let's look again at another pair gbp usd let's look at gbp usd and see so for gbp usd we go again to what the hour four okay so from the hour four currently you are saying what we are in what an uptrend okay we are in an uptrend you see like this basically is what the market have been pumping up gbp usd has been pumping up so now you also want to see what the same what trend in the lower time frame but now this is the opposite so which means there is no entry for now you are just going to what take your book or write your journal you journal for example gbp usd h4 you write what uptrend then m5 currently downtrend you keep on checking until you get a legit entry okay so now all you need to know that you have already know that the major trend is like this you just need to wait until what the five minute time frame matches what our macro trend then you can basically what just go ahead and what take your entry for this case let's see if we can basically see like this one so like this you go to the h4 okay like this for the h4 we say well this is an opt all right this is a buying opportunity so let's see if the m5 matches so now m5 basically is what dropping so you want to what you want to wait because the h4 is going to like saying this what an a major buy opportunity so if you come to this one you want to wait until what candles like what bullish candle starts forming okay bullish candle starts forming then you can what just go ahead and what enter okay the body of the candle is very important okay the body is what very very important so for example now we are seeing like what a green candle trying to form okay a bull, bullish candle is trying to form so if this can, candle basically forms and what enters what and reaches this particular point here then which means this trade is going to be legit okay for it to work for you to enter okay so let's look for another pair on you are just going to do this with this particular strategy you need to what exercise patience you need to what exercise a whole lot of patience okay so this is what uh, there is a crossover from the 23 moving average which is basically what the red okay so now let's see if we can basically if these are like both equal so this is what is like what a buy opportunity as well okay but for me you are saying like what the 23 basically is what telling you to what buy so this one does not match you have to wait until you see what a what a project like you can basically use that matches okay like this is what currently what thou in what a downtrend okay and you go to the five minute time frame again 
you are seeing here like a downtrend forget about the candle that are forming all you need to do is like just wait for price to reverse again just wait for price to reverse at this particular point and you start seeing what a red candle then that's a what good sell opportunity as well so what i'll try to do again i'll try to combine this particular strategy with our sniper entry strategy all right which is using the platform moving average and that of the rsi to take what our entry okay so if you have not subscribed ensure you do subscribe if you find value in this particular video and if you want to see me trade this particular strategy all right just subscribe turn on your bell notification icon because i'll be trading this strategy as well to flip what my small account all right just to motivate you guys if you basically find value just drop 100 in the comment section and let me know the amount you want me to flip all right with this particular strategy let me know the amount whether it's from ten dollar to one thousand dollar fifty dollar to one thousand hundred to one thousand let me just know what you can afford so i can basically use this strategy so you guys can say like this strategy is legit all it needs what you need to what exercise patient okay you just need to exercise patient with this particular strategy so guys this is basically the setup of the strategy i believe like this is very straightforward and very easy okay all you need to know is like what we have two emas the 10 moving average which is the blue and the 23 which is what the red the you start you are only going to use two time frame the hour four which is the macro trend must be what equal to that of what the five minutes because this is what is scalping okay the major trend must be equivalent to that of what the minor trend so guys this is basically it i'm Josawo. ensure you subscribe like and share this video if you are interested in getting free signal check join and check the description of this video join my telegram community and they are going to be getting the whole lot of what signals and other trading materials i also teach people for free if you are interested you are a beginner all right in forex and crypto trading i do teach for free just send me a message by instagram whatsapp uh, twitter or you can also join my telegram channel and my whatsapp number is going to be in the description of this video just click the link write me up and you'll be added to our community so guys basically this is it see in upcoming video stay blessed i'm joe Zao.